Hello everyone, my name is Matilda Amakonedu Tutu, aka Miss Obaba. So I'm from Ghana and I live in the US, um, Columbus, Ohio. So I created this, um, the wedding game, hmm, the title, the wedding game. The reason why I created this group is um, to help our youth because um, in doing middle school, high school, we go to a lot, you know, we go to a lot that Sometimes you don't have anyone to talk to. Sometimes you feel like nobody understands you because it's just you in the boat and trying to survive on your own. But I created this group to help our youth. Like the things that we go through, when you're having sexual feelings, you know, who do you talk to? Is it a normal thing? Um, is it okay to feel like you want to have sex sometimes? And also, like, we are, like, in a rush. We want to just, you know, grow up quickly. We want to turn 18, do all the things that we want to do. So I created this group based on my own personal experience. Like, living in the USA, going to middle school, going to high school, the struggle is real. Especially when you don't have someone to look up to or someone to talk to or someone that actually understands your pain your struggle and you feel like you're on your own but this page is here to help you out to you know to answer all the questions that you might have you know as a teenager and the struggles that actually you go through and then this question this page is also for our youth how we say um like when you are use, losing your virginity who do you want to have sex with are you in love do you love the person? Are you going to marry the person or not? You don't know that. So why go and have sex with that person? So this page will also talk about stuff like that. You know, we will go deep in, into that at some point, you know, hopefully before this year end. But I work towards it. So there's a lot that we actually go through. And then when you become an adult, now you want to go in a relationship you want to set it down. You want to meet your Mr. Right, your Mrs. Right. And then, you, you know, you're searching, looking, trying to see if you find the right person, someone that will love you for you, someone that will not judge you, someone that will not want you to change to fit the expectation. But let me tell you, you are beautiful. You are handsome. You are good. You are perfect just the way you are. Yeah, you might have some flaws. You might have some things that you need to work on. But your partner shouldn't be with you just because you are perfect or just because you are good at this. They should be with you no matter, how, no matter how bad, no matter how ugly things might get, or no matter how imperfect you are, they should love you just the way you are to be with you. So we will talk about that too as well in this group. So the title of the wedding game, I know people might think the game, like what game are we playing? You know, life is full of risks. The risk, and I put it as wedding game, the game is risks, but it's game. Because you are going to school right now. You are playing chess, you are playing game, right? You're taking classes. How do you know you're gonna pass the class? You have to study hard. You have to read your books to pass. So that is game that you're playing right there. You're planning to date. The person that you date, how do you know it will end up in a relationship? How do you know it will end up in a serious relationship? How do you know it will end up in marriage? You don't know that, right? Because what? You are waiting and you are playing game because you are playing game right now. It's risk that you are taking. So the title actually inspired me a lot. Because I have been praying a lot, like so many years since I was like young, that I want to do a YouTube channel, you know, to help the youth. I just didn't know the title, where to start, or how to start from. So this page, you'll be talking a lot about so many different things, so many different things that we you will be talking about. A lot of things, different device, different title, different topic, different everything. So tune in. So we have a I have a lot of juicy juicy stuff for you guys and i know you will love it so let's get back to this so we most not all of us but most teenagers here 
don't want to work they want they just want to jump and be rich the question is why are you rushing why don't you just enjoy your teenager years go and hang out with your friends do things that teenagers do go and watch movies go and do fun stuff because when you become an adult you have bills to pay you don't have an excuse oh i don't want to go to work today i just want to sleep and rest no you don't have time for that because you have you are busy focusing on other things so now that you have a time now that you have chance now that you have free time my teenager my young adult go have fun Take a vacation if you can. Spend time with your family. Because when you become an adult, you won't even have that time because you are too busy. Hang out with your parents. Watch a movie with your mom and dad. You don't always have to hang out with your friends. Because your mom's advice, your dad's advice will help you a lot to go along with. Because you think, oh, my mom don't understand me. My dad don't understand me. Yeah, they might not understand what you are going through at the moment. But I'm here to tell you that they can advise you on a lot of things. So my my youngest, my youth, I'm here to bring good news, to guide you through to becoming an adult. Because I know it's hard. It's a struggle. It's painful. And it makes everything even more hard just because you don't know where to start from. You don't know where to go. You don't know who you are yet. You're still trying to discover who you are. Luckily, most people know what they want to become when they are like in middle school. Even before they could become, if they come to high school. You are about to graduate from high school. You don't know what career you want to do. You don't know what you want to major in. It's okay. Go try something new. Go for your passion. What do you love to do when you have a free time? What do you love to do when nobody's watching you? What do you love to do? You know, go for it, girl. Go for it, boy. I have faith in you. I believe in you. I know you can do it. So um, I just want to make this page more fun, very educating, very exciting. So I'm a social worker, um, and this has inspired me a lot to do this because of maybe my major that I focus on, and I realized our youth are really struggling. They're going through pain. They're actually bleeding and they need help. They need our support. Parents, our kids, they need you. You think they don't need you because they are all grown? No, they are bleeding inside. They need your help. They need your assistance. They need your support. They need your encouragement. Sometimes you don't need to say anything. Sometimes we don't need your advice. We just want you to be there when we are crying, when we are in pain. Just be there. Just be there. Don't say anything. Just be there. So I have a lot of fun things in store. And I get, I'll get more inspiration as time goes on. And I'm sure I'll upload some interesting stuff here that you actually love. And I know I'm going to learn a lot as well from you guys. And also through some research and investigation that I will do on my own. So... Tune in for more juicy stuff from Miss Miss Obapa. Tune in for more juicy stuff from Miss Obapa. Okay, so thank you for watching and I hope to see you soon. Subscribe, like, and comment. Okay, bye.